Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back again. So, as promised, I will be reacting to more of these Man in the Suit incidents. And this time, we're going to be dealing with the Angira Suit incident from 1955. This was made by the OG unknowingly, so with that being said guys, let's go ahead and check this out. That dance is like, really? I can't believe they actually rolled with that for the English duck. <laughs> Something's happening. Oh no. All right, the man in the Gojira suit came, still came along to the next movie. If they stopped and told anyone about the suit man, Toho would have been sued and ridiculed for keeping such a disgusting cre creation. So they decided to keep him out of the public eye so that they could thank God for the success of Gojira. Okay. I got scared because you, know you know how it is when it comes to reading. I like to like kind of read fast just in case. So I don't, I don't like to pause too much, but Toho wanted to find out the ultimate cause for all of this. What was the ultimate cause, huh? What was it? The man in the suit has been examined by private doctors. The doctors weren't really sure about the cause, saying it might be a pill, but they weren't certain when they were certain about, or what they were certain about was the outcome. Whatever he took or had made his skin and flesh inflate in the inner suit, melting and fusing together, somehow the outside of the suit was now his skin. Oh! I love this reading exercise. Mmm! Sci-fi st 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 stutter. It's been a hot minute. I don't usually read like that. <laughs> his bones were rearranged inside to match with the height of the suit. Well, that doesn't sound pleasing at all, does it? He can somehow fill the outer layer of the suit as it was his own skin. Uh-oh. I can't imagine what it's like, though, just being stuck in the suit of Angiris. You'd be, like, on all four legs, like, forever. It turned out that he could see out of the eye sockets of the suit, but his eyes were bloodshot. Okay, I can, I can imagine that. Yeah, that, I ain't gonna lie, that, that's a creepy picture of Godzilla right there. What the hell? His eyes were bloodshot. Bro, like, okay, I, I don't wanna, I don't wanna see the zoom, I, that, that just makes it even worse. But no, like, on some real shit, like, no, that, that is actually pretty terrifying to look at. Like, imagine have a, having a eye staring contest with that thing. Hell no. Uh-oh. What's going on? Sorry, I don't do too well with noises. The name for the actor who plays in Gears is Redacted. Hmm. I wonder why it's Redacted. Said, noticed how he was audited out by the man in the suit. No one cared to tell him what happened and what he what he has become. Okay. The man in the Gojira suit was very cooperative. Even after losing his vocal cords, he could still make noises like one of an animal. Oh God, no! So you tell me he can't like wait. Okay, now that's terrifying as hell to think about. So you can't say anything, but you're just like mm -hmm, mm -hmm, in the suit. God, I would hate to be in that position. Everything would go great until the last scene they had to do where they would both fight. Okay, so this, they're talking about that final fight from uh, Godzilla Raids again before Angiris' death. Yeah, it was a pretty brutal fight, honestly, for Godzilla's first fight. Still still holds up pretty well to this day. Okay. I'm getting worried, bro. Like, all these dark screens. Oh, man, my neck. Oh, every time I look at that part, every time, bro, it makes my neck. It hurts. And it's even worse that he pauses it. On this frame. Oh, okay, okay, okay. The man in the Gojira suit would chomp on the actor's head, making him bleed profusely. This was never a part of the script. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It's gone wrong miserably already. And again, this is fictional. Keep, keep that in mind. The actor would yell painfully for help as the teeth clamped onto his head. Seconds later, the actor would stop moving. So he died. He died on set. Or did he? The man in the suit would protect the unconscious actor as he warded anyone who 
who came close to the unconscious after. Interesting. So why would you protect something that you took a nice bite out of? That's some ass backward logic. The actor would awaken, shaking violently as he struggles to get up from the ground. The crew on the set helped him up, fearing the worst they tried to take off the suit. It wouldn't budge. Not even a little bit. It just would not budge. This reminds me of a haunted mask from Goosebumps in a way, if you think about it. The picture was somehow taken when, in, or my fault, when the man in the suit roaring and protecting the unconscious actor. What does this picture look like? Da, 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 da. This music's really unsettling. I don't like it. It's a compliment. This is the picture. Uh oh. Be prepared for jump scares. I don't know what's about to happen. Oh my god, it's the eyes though. Fuck is that? You see the eyebrows too? I don't like how they look like that. That that is totally not normal. Okay, like, bro, stop staring at me. Let's go to the next frame. Hurry. These noises aren't helping. Okay. All right, we're good. We're good so far. We're doing fine. Okay. Uh-oh. Okay. This is what they expected. So this is like a before and after again, kind of like with uh, the Godzilla incident. All right, this music's kind of giving me hope, you know, maybe some happiness at the end. It's like, and again, if I have to cut through this for the copyright, that's why. I'm sorry, even for a stick figure, that looks like a lot of stress. What was that? What was that about? Did you see that little frame? This is what they found. Okay. Oh, the music. Oh, I'm getting chills down my back. Stop that. I, I hate when it does this stuff. This reminds me of like um, Dead Silence. It does the same thing with the music. It gets all slower and creepier. Okay, my breath. Bro, I'm gonna hold my breath. Okay. Ah! Okay. We're doing fine. Oh, that's it? I personally still think the Godzilla students thing was a little bit more creepier than this one. But don't get me wrong, I swear to God, that tension all the way to the end, like that's what I love to see in these type of videos. Like, you know, that slow suspense and it plays with your mind trying to figure out what's going to happen next. But the one thing I can't stop thinking about is just that face at the end of the video. Like, what was that about? Like, imagine you're waking up and then boom, like, that's the face you fucking meet. I'll definitely be reacting to more of these. I know that there's the Mothra and King of Dora suit incident. And as always, unknowingly, great job on this video. Other than that, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Subscribe if you love these men in the suit incidents. And I'll see you guys the next time. Peace.